So, I'm just leaving the house this morning. I'm a few minutes late, as usual. But we're heading to uh, Giant Stadium, AKA MetLife, yeah, MetLife Stadium, easy for me to say. Still an early morning, it was a late night at the shop, but um, heading up to MetLife for the SCCA Pro Solo this weekend. And I'm driving uh, a new car that I haven't driven before. So, um, yeah, it's going to be interesting. We'll see how it goes. All right, so just got here. And uh, here he's going right now. So, had a couple of runs in the new car, and uh, so we'll do a quick walk around while uh, we're taking a break. But uh, this is a brand new GT4 RS. It is PDK, we are running Hoosiers, and uh, yeah, it's just a fun little car. Are the seats different colors? Or is it just yeah, my... This is a special seat. This is the uh, extra $3,000 insert. Interesting. It saves half a pound. Right. I guess it has this thing that you can wire the harness through. And it's slightly lighter. Huh. The available, another thing is like... Uh, they're available in three softness levels. So this is like a medium. You can get like a softer or stiffer. Huh. So Interesting. Uh, and the funny thing is, it's just the, uh, it's just the this piece where I guess from here, right down. Here. Yeah. And they take the original. They really? Take the original off. They put it in a bag. They leave it in the trunk. So I have it in my house. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. So I can make the other side like <laughs> right, yeah. the same as other. So if I wear this out, I have just right, regular yeah, seat, which actually one. feels about the same. It does look like somebody was telling me. It looks like the angle is a little bit steeper, right? Yeah, maybe. I don't know. But it does not feel much different when you drive. No, it really doesn't. It didn't feel to me any different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. Interesting. Yeah, Porsche does weird things like that. Huh. <laughs> oh, whatever, I want to try. Yeah, no. No, I mean, it's worth worth trying. Yeah, I think we, I think we got the Hoosiers burned in. They're A7s though, obviously. Yeah. 295, 30, 19 well, in the, the back. And actually, it rubs already. Like, you can actually see that it touches. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It definitely touches. Yeah, it's definitely getting a little. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you can feel a little bit of rubber there. Yeah. Yeah, it shows us. This is like only 295s. 235, 35s in the front, huh? Yeah. Because they don't have, I mean, you have to go 265, but I feel like. It, yeah. First of all, I cannot go any lower on the suspension because right. I got the um, the lift, the front lift. Right. So the front lift actually limits how much you can lower the suspension. So this is the lowest you can go in the front. Right, right, In the right. rear, I can go another maybe 15 millimeters lower if I wanted. But right. even this like, sounds like... Yeah, that. I don't know if I'd go much lower. You shouldn't be going any lower. Yeah. Well, we were jumping sideways. No, I know. We were jumping the <laughs> We were car. jumping yeah. sideways and landing sideways. So yeah. it's... it's uh, this is probably as especially bad as this get. side, yeah. yeah especially as, as in the beginning. I mean, it's probably that right, yeah, right the there, yeah. So that's I mean, you were jumping it bigger than I was. Yeah, the car. Okay, well, the other thing I wanted to say is like this initial turn. Yeah. You can get on a gas airlift. 
It's just gonna take yeah. it. Yeah. It's just gonna take it. It doesn't spin. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like so stable in first gear for whatever reason. It's so stable in that corner. Just mm. like you can, like don't abruptly, right. but like you can go faster. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just it's off just the line. It. It's just gonna take it. And yeah, that's yeah. why I was jumping harder. Right, because right, yeah. Right. Guys, yeah. Guys yeah, 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 for sure. Cool. Yeah, so the rear of the car is heavily limited by the rear with like 295, I mean for Porsche it's like nothing. Yeah, no, I know. Those, those like GT3 RS runs like 355. Yeah, they're huge. <laughs> yeah. Know? And they still have the, and I cannot go any more in because the 19 inch wheel will rub on that wheel. Oh, on the inside? I actually, yes, I had, I actually already have two sets of these wheels. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. As I said, it's only three millimeters more inside and it rubs. Right. Yeah. Okay, let me let me see if it wraps here. I don't think because we, like, yeah, I heard this. I, I heard it pretty hard. Like I, I'm not going to touch it. Yeah. I don't think it wraps. Yeah. I doubt. I doubt that it wraps. But pretty much the three millimeters in wraps. Right. On the street. Yeah. I, yeah, I, yeah. I, well, I mean, I, I was drifting on the street, but sure, but still. Right. <laughs> yeah. So I got two sets. I get first set three millimeters more out than than a stock, but it's 19 inch, so yeah, it gets closer. Right. And I right. drove on the street and it wrapped. Yeah. And then I got just the rears and as the three millimeters out and it didn't wrap on the hmm. street. It's probably not gonna wrap on the street. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Huh. Oh, that's so I should show this to Pat Salerno, he'll be disappointed. He, Pat Salerno's getting the car. Yeah, it's already on order. Yeah, it's no, I, I've, I've been he's watching like this post. Delay, like he's still wait, like his, his, uh, his arbitrarily delayed just like mine was. Right, yeah, of course. Does it actually have a pearl in it, the paint? Or is it just like no, a no, flat just, color? It's 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 a, it's a film, right? I already has a film. Right, right, right. I don't know, no, but it, it looks like there's like like down here is some not speckles. No, that's just dust. Just dust. That's dust. Yeah. That's definitely dust. Yeah. I mean, you want to be in a, like you want to look where somewhere where it's clean. <laughs> right. Yeah. Especially <laughs> the, the back, back of the car. It's like it's really dusty. Yeah. Well, the back you got the exhaust, brake dust, tire stuff. So. So we just got finished doing the test and tune over at MSNE. We didn't really uh, we didn't really mess around with the car setup too much, but we think we're gonna make the rear sway bar a little softer. Um, we're having some issues just kind of getting the car to transition well, um, so we're just doing that. But uh, right now we're just kind of making our way over to the Pro Solo lot and. Uh, Pulling up to these homies right here, get signed in. I'm gonna be doing this later. So, what's happening? So, they decided to throw me some tools, and some aluminum, and uh, I had to make. Mount carabiner and a things and a TV mount, Woo. and then I had to do cables and things and all the stuffs. So we're off to do some practice launches, and then I work. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> Saturday morning, June 3rd, uh, it is, I gotta make that thing shut up, um, yeah, it's like 30 degrees colder than it was yesterday, maybe 35 degrees colder than it was yesterday, probably not cold enough to be wearing a jacket, but I'm actually comfortable wearing a jacket, a hoodie, and pants right now, whereas yesterday we were dying in basically 100 degree weather. I'm going to get some bagels and coffee, um, you know, being in the old hood, it's time to get some real bagels, none of this South Jersey crap. Oh yeah, and the power steering's been whining like crazy. I think this thing's just pissing fluid, like, instantly. I, I filled the bottle literally two days ago. It's getting worse by the day, I feel like. May need to do rack in this thing because that's what's leaking. 
unfortunately. But, yeah. <laughs> Good morning. Mark it's a uh, Sunday morning. I'm listening to the live feed for the Pro Solo while I run around the old hood. And uh, I'm actually stopping to get some bagels because we don't have good bagels in South Jersey anymore. So, well, anymore. I, South Jersey doesn't have good bagels. It's just not the same. So, I'm uh, getting bagels at our old spot, J&J. &J, and... Uh, then I'm gonna head over to the Pro Solo and hopefully I'm awake by then, but probably not. So, yeah. Changes. And good night in with that cone. 42 Ryan with the cone. And your oh boy, I'm gonna be watching the fox here. Mike, wow, matches his time on the left to the thousand. Doug Rouse slow by 80,000. <laughs> so, <laughs> Doug Rouse on the right, Doug hanging by Fred onto that lead with Grant Reed hot on his heels. Grant in. Now.